Okay, right. Normally, we're talking about negative stuff and pointing out negative people. But on this video, on this recording, I wanna talk about some people that I agree with. I'm gonna start off with Damon Hill because I think he's the bottom of this list. Because when we was watching the racing, Formula One Grand Prix in Abu Dhabi when Lewis Hamilton was ripped off and he should have won his eighth title, but they took it away from him. Damon Hill was stood there and he was like he was going to say something, then realized everybody else wasn't and then kind of backtracked a little bit. But he could see in his face, he was like, are we really doing this? Like he was looking at the rest of them like, is this, is this really happening? Like he wanted to say something, like he did say something and he was waiting for a comeback from the other person. And that comeback was like diluting what happened. And he was a bit taken back. It, it just, at the time, I remember looking at him thinking, just say what you want to say. But he didn't, but he could tell that he wanted to. And he was, it was taken back by the whole thing. Like, are we really doing this guys? Did, did we not just see what we just seen? Or we're not going to talk about what we just seen? Basically like that. But it did tone it down after that. So he wanted to say something, but he was kind of caught in the moment and didn't. And then we've got Gian Pablo Montana. I'm going to put um, a link to his video. He's being interviewed in a car by some um, sports, I don't know, some, I don't know, some woman. She's interviewing him. And everything he says, everything he says, I agree with. Near enough, everything I agree with. From what I can remember, I can't say everything. In case you go and watch and it's something that I don't, I can't remember. But he's talking about, he even says Mercedes, they should fight it till the end. He was saying that the racing didn't seem right. Points out how the um, FIA or the stewards, Michael Massey basically, was all over the place with the rules. It would, it would throw a... It would put a safety car out and then it'll be a red flag after teams have pitted under the safety car it doesn't make sense because then all teams can pit and change the tires so that pit stop that someone chose to do under the safety car is irrelevant and they've lost out because they went from safety car to red flag so they're straight to red flag he was talking about stuff like that but it's, it's a good little it's, it's good and then we've got ted kravitz on the day he was hyped what's going on here then we're supposed to do this and we're supposed to do that Normally, Ted Kravitz is a bit annoying. Nearly all the Sky Sports people annoy me a little bit. But Ted Kravitz was excited, but shocked. And he wanted to talk. He wanted to, he wanted to get in there like, well, why did they do this? And why did they do that? They should have done this and should have done that. Ted Kravitz, Craig Slater, Johnny Herbert. I can't like get into, I can't remember off the top of my head. But I just know that them names are in my mind of people that have spoken. People that have spoken some truth. Damon Hill tried to, so he's on, he's, he's kind of, he's, he's making the list, but only just, only just. John Pablo Montana, Ted Kravitz, Craig Slater, Johnny Herbert. There might be more. There might be more, but they're the ones I can think of right now. And they're the ones that said something. Even if it was just a little bit, it was more than nothing. More than nothing. So they're people that have a kind of, I want, I want to, if they're on TV, I will listen. If they're on TV, I will listen because they had something about them. They, they were, they were men. They've seen something, they felt something and they spoke what they seen and felt. That's a man. Now, if there's any ladies watching, I'm not trying to be sexist against you. That's just what I see. Like, I don't expect, some women do do that and it's great when they do. But I don't expect that from a woman. I don't, it's not something I expect, but that's something I expect from a man. You see something, you feel something, you say what you think and you feel. Be man about it. And that's, I don't think that's a sexist thing. So any girls that watch, women that watch, ladies that watch, don't take offense to that. It's just not something I look for in a woman. I don't mind. It's not what I expect, but I do expect it from men. I do. And when a man don't do that, I see him as less of a man. I see him as a hypocrite. Like stand for what you believe properly and strongly. And say what you think and feel and you will gain respect from other men. So that's why the people in this list, one more time, Damon Hill just makes it. 
John Pablo Montana. I hope I'm saying his name right. I'm sure I am. Ted Kravitz, Craig Slater, Johnny Herbert. And I'm, I might miss somebody else off. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I'm missing somebody off yet. But I just wanted to make a little... I wanted to speak about the people that are worth speaking about instead of being negative all the time. All right. Let me know what you think. Chuck somebody else out there. I'll go and watch a video. Send me a link or something. I'll watch it. All right. I'm out of here.